The city of Monash has been forced to cancel a children's drag-themed storytime event after staff were bombarded with death threats from neo-Nazis and protesters. Police were forced to intervene after white supremacist Thomas Sewell vowed to crash the library reading. Lana Murphy explains. With narrow views but loud voices. Leave the children alone! A small but raucous crowd made their feelings clear. Monash Council is committed to child safety and all events and programs are developed. And today they won. It's really shattering. A drag queen hosted story time at Oakley Library cancelled after organisers, hosts and staff were told they'd be killed. Everyone can wander into the library, they know where librarians work and so these sorts of threats and intimidation um, creates a, a really unsafe workplace for people. Leading the hate, neo-Nazi Thomas Sewell, who threatened to crash the May 19 event with his far-right followers. Tensions boiling over between pro and anti-trans supporters at last week's meeting. Sack you all! Sack you all! Where police were forced to escort councillors out. Not an exercise of free speech, but an exercise in hate speech, violence, bigotry, racism sexism, uh, 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 homophobia. This afternoon, the Premier didn't hold back. If you want to behave like the worst elements of the Floridian uh, Republican Party, well, get to Florida. Head over there, where your hateful views might, might be worth something. They're worth nothing here. After consultations with police, the city of Monash said it was left with no choice. Our drag story time event was designed to introduce children to diverse role models and encourage acceptance, love and respect. It's so disappointing that some people have a long way to go before this is achieved. Lana Murphy, Nine News.